Litherland High, we are based on the whole ethos of achieving by caring. But one particular part of that is that we are a global learning community. We have links with schools across the world. And it's very, very important for us that at any moment in time, we can connect with our other schools. When we sat down in 2006 and realised we wanted a managed service, we had to find a partner who could do what we wanted. And we looked far and wide and extensively. And then we ended up with Northgate Managed Services as a supplier that could meet what we wanted. They were able to tell us what other people did and what other schools did. They were able to organise visits for us so we could see what was going on. And we were confident that we were a good partnership and that would work. In the old school, uh, we had a very, very prominent uh, thick client provision, which is traditional old style computers. The advantage of coming over to the new school is that we were able to wipe the slate clean and go for a thin client estate. All these computers are basically dumb terminals and they go back to a big server environment which does all of the processing and all the, all the kind of needs of all the students and the staff around the school. That's had the advantage of being able to buy more devices, so we're now looking at one computer for every student that's in the school. These computers now, they virtually gain no heat, so cooling requirements of the school and the energy requirements mean that we don't pay as much out in electricity and things like that, which means that the school has more revenue funding over time to spend back into the IT budget or whatever other ideas or requirements the school has. Northgate's early involvement meant that we were actually able to trial some of the latest technologies available. We tried different software applications, we tried different scenarios in terms of the curriculum in which, in which we operate and found that it was the right way for us to go and so that early, early involvement in the piloting of those kind of procedures gave us, gave us some confidence in going for the solution that we've ended up with in the new school. We were able to get project managers on board at an early stage to talk to all the key stakeholders in the project, so the M&E contractors, the building contractors, the school and the local authority. Uh, with Northgate being there to facilitate some of those discussions, we were able to say, this is Liverland High's vision, this is what we want to achieve via our ICT strategy, and Northgate were able to facilitate our ideas and visions and plans rather than being shoehorned into somebody else's way of thinking when it comes to IT. We knew that we were going to move into our new building on the 21st of February 2011 and we knew that two days later the children were going to turn up and at year 11 or halfway through their exams. It was important to us we lost no time. From day one we had 12 people in from Northgate. They were here to help with everything and anything and by the following Monday we were operating as if we'd been operating in a school for the last five years. The perceived challenges before we moved over from the old school into the new school building was the teachers being proficient quickly in the use of the new technology. We did some work with Northgate before we came over to the building which was working in, in subject groups, bringing them up to speed on the, the programmes and the technology that was going to be available when we got into the new school. What was done swiftly and efficiently was the training set up by Northgate. Teachers knew where to access the resources from. It felt like a team. Those first couple of weeks it really did feel like a team between Northgate the students and the teachers as well. The recent investment in technology has enhanced the learning experience through the reliability. So the, we know that Northgate, if there's an issue, if there's a problem, we know that it will be dealt with swiftly and effectively and efficiently. We've been a best practice ICT school for some time now and it's more an enhancement and more innovative use of ICT and embedding it and getting the children and the students to use more ICT independently to to promote lifelong learning but also to encourage them to be more independent and more responsible for their own learning. There's a mixture of techniques within the teaching, for example, within L3, the new curriculum which is language living and learning. In that, um, we have about 17 teachers all working together and this is 17 teachers within lots of different departments and we're bringing the curriculum together so it's not one classroom going into another classroom, the door closes, another class, everyone's working together. So everything's a lot quicker and up to date and we can actually move with things that are actually happening in the world today. We use the iPads for Skype in different countries in language lessons and we can take them to other countries to record what we've done and play it back to other years to show them how we do it. It's helped a lot because it gives you a real life situation more than just talking to your teachers because we have to use our language skills to communicate with them so it's helped a lot. And because of that, language skills have improved dramatically over the past couple of months. The improvement that we've seen primarily in student performance is the innovative use of ICT in mathematics. That has really 
raise the game for us for GCSE Mathematics. You can now log on to your area from at home and access all your files and the shared files. So any notes that a teacher's given you in school, you can now revise from them at home and it makes things a lot easier. It boosts my grades a lot as well because I'm doing more revision because it's more simple and interactive. More teachers are planning better resources. Um, the reason they're planning better resources is because they've got access to all of these facilities and the new technologies. It's becoming easier to see from observations that they're more confident in the teaching. If their confidence is there, if you believe you can do something, then you're obviously going to achieve and perform. And obviously because of the new technology, it's bright, it's colourful, it's engaging. The pupils are enjoying themselves and the teachers are enjoying teaching as well. It's the new software that's made the impact because compared to the old school, I can now finish my working lessons a lot easier and quicker. It's all very more advanced than what it was. There's a lot more computers everywhere. There's enough for one each in every lesson virtually. And it's made it a lot easier to do your work on time and finish it. You can access the internet, you can use all the software and it really it helps you to get on with your work and it's more fun and interesting than working out of a book. I think the new ICT has pulled my grades up a lot and that'll only help me to get a really good job in the future. So the use of ICT has not only impacted on student results, it has made them more aware of their responsibilities towards the environment. Follow me printing makes them think before they print and makes them aware of as they print it costs money and there is an impact on the environment. We do see ourselves as a global learning community and that's the plan for the future that we are able to deliver that because we're confident that we've got the IT behind us. We've been rated as outstanding at Ofsted twice in three years. It's very important for us and if our partners are outstanding as well. Ofsted have been in since we moved into the new building and we got outstanding because of things like behaviour, because of learning, because of teaching um, and because of the general ethos of the school and very much they highlighted when they were talking to us about how IT is everywhere but it's used. The big thing in this school is that the IT is usable and is used. We now feel that we've got an IT system that allows us to be totally innovative. Teachers can depend on it working, they don't need to have a plan B for a lesson. Northgate are proud of what they're doing in the school. I don't know what the contract says because we've never gone to the contract. It's always been, can we help you? What can we do to make this better? And that you do feel in some ways that they feel that they, they own the IT in the school, although they're managing it for us, they take such pride in it. And I don't sense at all that we're having a relationship with somebody who's counting up at the end of every day how many pennies they've made from the school.